Okay, YouTube, just a, a little quick video. Here's YouTube on my iPad, resting on somebody's leg. And Fire Destroys Beloved Renton Grocery Store. It took me like five looks at Google Maps to figure out where this store is because I've lived in Renton for six years. And like, what the hell? And then this lady who said she works here was interviewed and then there's like four different cuts of her being interviewed and whining and complaining that oh this is where we met all our friends at to buy our produce i work here for the last three years it's such a small awesome com community co-op of a grocery store and i'm just like yo this is my comment. Barely ever heard of this store and I've lived in Renton Highlands for six years. Why is this lady acting like there's no other grocery stores on Northeast 4th to shop at, to work at, to buy her apples at? This lady be like five apples short of a pie. And mind you, th this lady's grocery store that she worked at was like two blocks away from a giant Safeway. And in the same neighborhood as a Fred Meyer... And an Albertsons, and a, and like t another two blocks away from QFC, like Safeway and QFC across the road from each other on a main drag. And then you know, if you want to go farther away, you can go to Wajamaya, which is like a, a Chinese Asian supermarket, or you can go to Viet Wa, which is like another Asian supermarket, or you can go to Grocery Outlet, which is you know a discount grocery store. There and and there's a Walmart and there's another Safeway and another Safeway and another Fred Meyer. Like lady, there are so many different options of grocery stores to shop at in Renton. That like just because you worked at an indoor produce stand that had extra other groceries, oh, you could go apply for a job at Carpetina Brothers. You know, in Kent. Even though that's not Renton. Like she just she acted like she was such a, an extrovert. Like, everybody she talks to in the grocery store is her friend. Like, why am, why am I ever going to see them again? Because the, our store was on fire today and had, like, 24 fire trucks at it. And now it's all burned to a crisp. But we're going to rebuild it. Seriously, y'all. This, this ain't like small town North Dakota with two, a thousand people in it. Like, you're, you're acting like this is the worst possible place to have a fire, and now you're out of a grocery store, period. No, you're not, lady. There are, like, 20 other grocery stores in Renton that you can shop at. Buy your apples somewhere freaking else. And, yeah, I might be insensitive, but it's just, like, annoying. Because she sounded like a Karen. And I sound like a Karen, too. I'm, I'm, I'm guilty of that, sure. But it's just, like, why? We're committed to rebuild and continue to support. And I love working here. It's been really great. So thank you. Reporting in rent. This is the heart of the community up here in the Renton Highlands. And tonight, many are feeling... Have a smile, to have some laughs, to buy great produce and fantastic organic meats. But now, this... For many of us, you know, so... It's just a lot of unknowns. It's still unclear what started the fire. Yeah. No clue what started the fire, but who who cares? The point is, this lady be whack. Like, there's no other grocery store she could ever shop at again to buy her damn apples. Fucking weird. 